What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to install the DeFi wallet on desktop, the plugin, how to do it the right way, and then we're going to try and connect it to the loaded lines main.city. Now when you jump on main.city, you're going to have an option to play now, we're going to hit that. Just let everything load through, this could take up to a few minutes depending on your internet speed. Now you're gonna have two options here, DeFi Wallet and MetaMask. So we're gonna go for DeFi Wallet, and then after you go ahead and click that, it's gonna actually load up a crypto.com wallet extension page here where you're going to have an option to add to Chrome. So we're gonna go and do that. Now you will need to use the Google Chrome browser, guys. That's gonna be the best one to use. It's gonna come up with a pop-up here, crypto.com wallet extension. We're gonna go ahead and click Add Extension. And there it is there on the top right corner, the crypto.com wallet extension. We're gonna open that up right now and we're gonna click get started. We're gonna go for the standalone wallet mode and we're gonna go ahead and create a new wallet. You can switch between the different type of extension modes even after you've created your wallet, so don't worry if you need to switch. Enter your passwords and then press create wallet. You're gonna go ahead and name that wallet. The key to your asset, your recovery phrase, if it's misplaced or stolen, it's the equivalent of losing your wallet. It's the only way to access your wallet if you forgot your account password. So make sure you save this special seed phrase, guys. Write it down and also save it on a USB and keep it safe. Do not lose this. If you lose this, you will lose access to all assets on this non-custodial DeFi wallet. Keep it safe. It's gonna be 12 words here, folks. So after you've saved them safely, hit proceed. It's then gonna ask you to enter four words here. For me, it's asking for word three, six, nine, then 12. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Then once you've done that correctly, it should say success, your wallet's created. Got it. All right, so as you can see, I've got my wallet fully set up here. There's a balance of zero crow. I'm on the Kronos chain. It's named Main City, and that's your public wallet address up there. You've got your balance here, your activity, options to send, receive, buy, swap. And then you've got a little tab for DAC rankings up here. So let's try and connect it to Main City now. The Main City's open here. All right, let's go ahead and choose DeFi Wallet. All right, Loaded Lines Main City. Would you like to connect to this particular wallet, guys? It's going to view your wallet balance and activity and request approval for transactions, guys. So let's allow the permissions there. Then a second window is gonna come up. Your signature is being requested. So you're gonna to have to scroll down, make sure you're happy with the message. Welcome to Loaded Lines Main City. Click to sign in. This request will not trigger a blockchain transaction or cost any fees, okay? So you go ahead and press sign. By clicking the confirm button, you are agreeing to the terms and conditions and acknowledging the privacy notice. Let's hit confirm. And there you have it, add crypto.com account. Link your crypto.com app account to include your crypto.com NFTs for in-game benefits. That's where we're gonna leave this video, folks. Now, if you do have some NFTs on your crypto.com app, you don't need to move them from the crypto.com app to the DeFi wallet. Do not do that. Don't send your NFTs from your crypto.com app to your DeFi wallet. Leave them on your crypto.com app. I'm gonna actually make another tutorial about how to connect this to your crypto.com app, but in a nutshell, it's actually really easy, so I'm gonna quickly explain it here as well. Essentially, you're just gonna go into your crypto.com app, you're gonna go into the settings section, all right? Then once you go into the settings section, you're gonna look for a QR code scanner in the top right-hand corner of the screen. It's got a little barcode scanner there, and you're just gonna use that to simply scan this QR code that you can see here on screen, and it's actually really simple, and that's gonna link your NFTs from your crypto.com app over to the DeFi wallet, which we literally just set up, and then you're going to be able to start playing. So I hope that was helpful, folks. If you enjoyed the video, if it helped you out, smash the like button, subscribe, turn the notification bell on, and share this video around. We'll catch you next time. Cheers.